Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to get my style of fake nails. Let's get started. As you can see I already did one of my hands but I'm going to be showing you how to start off with a bare hand and I'm going to be filing the tops of my nails. This isn't very good for your nails but um, I like to do it so that it um, makes the nail stick better so yeah. So now we're just going to use a normal nail file and file our nails like normal. So now we are going to begin applying. These are the Kiss nails and I'm going to have a picture of the, um, the brand I use. It is the tips, actually. They're not real fake nails, but yeah. Um, these are pre-shaped. Well, I shaped them myself to each individual nail, and yeah. Okay, so I'm going to be using the KISS Maximum Speed Nail Glue. This stuff works really well, so basically I just spread that all around my natural nail and then glue on the um, fake nail and I do that to the rest of my nails. If you haven't already noticed, there is Spongebob music in the background, but it is pitched, so I don't get copyrighted because I don't want to get any copyright strikes, but yeah, I really like this song, and um, yeah. <laughs> As you can probably see, I had a little bit of struggles with this middle nail because I glued it on crooked, which you do not want to do, so be careful. I didn't want to redo it, so I just left it and um, I fixed it later in the video, so don't worry about that. So as you can see, these nails are super square, so now it's time to shape them, and I'm going to show you how to do that next. So you can definitely see the difference in the nail shapes. One is square, and one is the stiletto, or I don't know, cat claw shape. So yeah, I'm going to be using scissors, nail scissors to be specific. But um, you can use regular scissors too, but I couldn't find mine. So yeah, you just want to line it up diagonally on the nail and then cut to get the stiletto shape. Alright, so I've done that diagonal thing to all my nails. Um, on one side and now I'm just gonna do the exact same thing actually no we're filing it sorry we're filing that down to give it a smoother edge and yeah the video is a little bit laggy and I don't like that try to fix that but 
Yeah. <laughs> So on the pinky nail I had a little bit of a difficulty while cutting so I'm just going to be gluing it back together because I cut like in the middle of it and that's not good so I glued it back together so it would stay together and yeah. Alright so now we're going to be doing the same exact diagonal cutting technique on the other hand so yeah I'm just going to be showing you that. Another important tip is to put the two nails of each hand next to each other. You want them to be the same length or else that will be very awkward. By now you're probably like, Mickey, this is too time consuming, and you are very right by that. <laughs> This video is not sponsored at all, but this show called Too Cute is so adorable. It's about like different types of pup, like there's puppies, kittens, I think there's like a mini horse one, I don't know, but I just wanted to show you um, a few clips of this really cute one, and it's a bunch of kittens, and I love this show, but it's not sponsored, so yeah. So after taking a lot of time to cut, file, and shape the nails, we are going to, like, I don't know, push away the shavings, and this is the final product, but we did not paint the nails yet, and you could totally see my legs, but yeah, um, I'm going to be using this nail polish, it, it doesn't look like that in real life, but yeah, and I'm going to be using a top coat as well, so get a top coat of your choice, get the color of your choice, and we are going to paint the nails. So I painted most of them except for one to show you all how I paint my nails. It's pretty self-explanatory, you just paint the nail and put a few coats until it is completely opaque. On the first coat it is definitely not opaque, but as you can see on the other nails, it is opaque after two or three coats, so yeah. I don't know why I was painting my nails so sloppily. I messed up so bad on that nail, um, but I fixed it. So yeah, I don't know why it came out messy, but um, I'm good at painting my nails, I promise. So after the nail polish is dry, we're just going to put a top coat on it, and yeah, that's basically the finished product. Um, I hope you all enjoyed this nail tutorial. If you did, give this video a huge thumbs up, send me pictures through Twitter or Instagram, at MeowMickey, and let's get on to the outro. Don't forget to subscribe, become part of the Mickey's Kitties family, and um, yeah, I upload new videos every Monday and Saturday here at 12pm Eastern Standard Time. I love you all so much, and bye guys!